According to a 2018 study on women and leadership conducted by the Pew Research Center, Americans see women and men as equally capable of leadership. In fact, the study also found that Americans believe women are better at standing up for, for what they believe in and working out compromises. So don't you think it's time for business women to speak up? Hi, I'm Elsa W. Smith, your Maryland estate planning and business attorney. At the law offices of Elsa W. Smith, we empower women through personalized estate planning and business consulting. In this video, I'll discuss three quick tips on how to be a more effective businesswoman by finding your voice. But first, I'd like to talk about why speaking up is so important. Stay tuned until the end of this video to find out how you can receive more free information for female business owners. Now, women tend to minimize their successes and strengths instead of telling others about them. While this reluctance for self-promotion can be perceived as humble, it's actually often seen as a lack of confidence. In my last video, I discussed how one of the barriers for women in business is difficulty finding investors. Now, investors tend to invest more in the person rather than the idea or the product itself. Therefore, women should highlight their accomplishments and professional qualities in order to raise the capital that they need. Minimizing successes and simply going with the flow can be harmful too for networking and promotion. Professional growth relies on respect and people rarely earn respect by staying silent and passive. Speaking up and being assertive shows confidence and being brave enough to share your ideas and opinions uh, commands the attention of others. While it can be intimidating to voice your opinion in a room full of professionals, women must remember that they have earned their seat at the table. The growth and success of a business depends on new and creative ideas and strategies, and your suggestions could revolutionize your company. So here are three quick tips on finding your voice. One, speak with conviction and intention. Two, come to a meeting prepared. And three, have confidence. Now, with respect to the first, Avoid presenting your ideas as suggestions. For example, say I know and, or I need instead of I think, uh, which is a lot weaker. The second, come prepared, make eye contact, address the entire room and remember your key points. And then lastly, have confidence. Don't be afraid to ask questions because chances are someone else in the room is probably thinking the same thing. Women have worked hard to break into the business world and have earned the right to share their ideas Ask for what they want and say yes or no if they so choose. Speaking up at work and sharing professional accomplishments can also give other women permission to speak up and inspire them to climb higher. Remember, others want to hear what you have to say and will respect you more for it. For assistance with business consulting as well as estate planning, I invite you to contact the law offices of Elsa W. Smith to schedule your consult today. You can visit our blog page or YouTube channel at Elsa W. Smith Law, get free information that can assist you in making informed decisions about your business and estate planning today. Again, I'm Elsa W. Smith, your Maryland estate planning and business attorney. Thanks for watching, and I will see you in my next video.